When people talk about Sterling engines, one of the things they like to talk about is efficiency. And let me light this one up and get it going. Um, let's, I have an idea to make this twice as efficient. Now, the rules of the game are I either get the same amount of work for half the fuel or I get twice the work for the same amount of fuel. And let's see if we can get this one up and running. She's thinking about it. There we go. Why are you being so stubborn today? Okay, so my proposal is to get twice the work for the same amount of fuel. And if we can run a second engine on the same flame, then we should Got a little bit of breeze that keeps moving the flame around. Well, we're close on. Yeah, if I can keep the flame steady, we're good. So, as you can see, it is possible to run both of these Sterling engines on the same flame. Um, and my guess is, if I had the wherewithal, I could probably run a third engine, one that was like, how should we say, uh, it's lower power, but um, more efficient. Eh, boy, that's really going to town. I can do that without cooking my thumb. My guess is the waste heat will... That's warm. Whoops. Yeah. But as you can see, we're getting roughly two and a half. We'll call this top one a half. Two and a half the power, two and a half times the power of just operating this one engine. This one likes a big flame. This one does not like, uh, this one is not really a, uh, what would you call it? It likes to be hot. It is a high temperature Sterling engine. But as you can see, we can run at least two and maybe two and a half. And if I had another one of these, I'm sure I could run it from the heat. So yeah, we could, uh, we could keep increasing our, uh, our efficiency by using just one flame and multiple engines. And then if we had a containment for that flame, uh, 
to preserve the heat even better. We could probably improve the uh, efficiency. So might be able to run five or six <laughs> engines uh, from just one flame. Okay, well that was it for this uh, little Sterling engine experiment in making it more efficient. Hope you found that useful and interesting in your home Sterling experimentation.